I hate lazy people. Why? We didn't even do anything. Ah, <laughs> form of laziness right here. Taking the Twitter post, putting it on Tumblr, and then sending it for me to read. <laughs> Classic lazy. Still read it, though. Eventually, they'll need to reinvent Superman's alter ego because nobody reads newspapers anymore. Clark Kent, the BuzzFeed editor. Ten people who are definitely not Superman. Meanwhile, BuzzFeed. <laughs> Wait, they have the new one coming out. What if they just do that? Men's section? <laughs> More like where the hot women shop. Women section? More like where the hot men shop. Soup section? More like, where's the clothes? I don't go to the gym because it says no food allowed and I'm a damn snack. I'm just following the rules. That's why you don't see me and Andy at the gym. Doesn't matter though, we're both incredibly jacked. Andy, put up, put up a picture of us. Yeah, see? Look. Authentic as hell. Music distracts me from whatever I want to do, but at the same time I can't do anything without music! Having bad sight has its upsides. People think I squint so much because I'm just focused on the conversation, while in reality, I'm just trying to see you! I just got diagnosed with forehead kiss deficiency. Me too. Maybe we could trade forehead kisses? I don't, I don't know, I just thought... if you wanted... What's gender anyway? Isn't gender that thing you make a smoothie in? No, no, that's a blender. Gender's when you give up fighting, I believe. <laughs> no, that's surrender. Gender is the person that serves you drinks at the bar. No, 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 that's bartender. Gender is those people in Atla that control elements. I don't know why I said Atla. I meant to say Avatar The Last Airbender, but y'all knew what I mean! Kind of funny when English teachers say stuff like, I can tell if you didn't read the book, or I can tell when people BS their paper. <laughs> no, you can't. You can tell when people are bad at BSing their paper. I didn't even read the Spock notes and barely scammed the Wikipedia, and you gave me an A. You kneel before my throne underwear that it was Born of lies! There is no difference between exercise and black magic broth. <laughs> black magic broth, what's wrong with me? Starting over! There's no difference between exercise and black magic. Both of them hurt your body at first and drain you of energy, but the more you dabble in it, the more powerful you become. That is the most inspiring thing I've ever read. Snom, has anyone tried to send you bad vibes and ass? Once. Did. Did Snob kill them? No. I think Snob did. I hate it when I misplace my glasses because I'm forced to walk around looking like I'm suspicious of everything in the room. What about you, cabinet? Huh? You sketchy piece of shit. Did you take them? Did you fucking take my glasses? Bloodborne is just Dark Souls, but wet. Pardon? Dark Souls is defined by its absence of anything resembling life. Miyazaki made a world that is almost utterly devoid of growth or flourishing at all. Everything is in the final stages of rot and decay, reduced to the cracking skeleton of what it once was. And not just metaphorically, the stone and grass and trees and just everything about it are so terribly dry. Bloodborne though. Bloodborne is fucking dripping wet. The stone in central Yarnum, wet. The bosses, wet. The weapons, wet. The combat, wet. The plot points, wet. The way it's so utterly obsessed with liquid, fresh death gore in a city of mist of ruin rather than having died off long ago, wet. I was on TikTok and I saw a video. I looked in the comment section and this guy is saying everything right. His comment was spot on. It was perfection. Like you read my fucking mind. I gave it a like then I realized something. I've seen it before. That was my own comment. You'd think I'd be ashamed, but I just think I'm the greatest. Overstimulation sensory overload really is like, sorry, I can't hear you over the sound of my shirt tag being itchy and these two strains of hair touching my face and the TV and one of the shoelaces being undone and air touching me and the plane flying overhead and my own thoughts about remembering to buy hummus! I can't talk, I have socks on! <sighs> Tumblr, I've warned you countless times about being a mood. I'm gonna need you to stop. This entire website could be deleted right this second, and I still wouldn't move to Twitter, sorry. <laughs> well, look whose account is deactivated. Where are you now, Steam and Sequences? Are you on Twitter? I think you might be. 
Oh my god, babe, kissing my knuckles, that's so... <gasps> stop! Stop! Stop licking my ring pop! <clears throat> According to a recent survey, 7 out of 10 people don't notice when a word in a sentence is replaced by a musical instrument. I hate you, Jeff. Oh my god, please don't embarrass me in front of the great stone obelisk for whence all darkness comes. Swear to God, Mom. On the bus and just watched a six-ish year old girl walk into a tree because she was reading and kept going without looking away from her page. Good on you, random girl. I've been there too. Keep walking. Keep walking. She's going places. Mostly into trees. Probably bad RPG idea. Make it easier to distinguish between in-character and out-of-character comments by doing all in-character dialogue three inches from the GM's face. Okay, so I'm gonna roll for initiative now on this guy, is that okay? Honestly saying, oh, it comes with lore about anything that has text explaining the use and or contents is one of the funniest things. Looks to instructions on my ramen package. Oh, lore! Lore on my ramen package? Call that a... Uh... Flavor text. Remember, toe beans are the signs of a killer. Funnily enough, I'm not 100% joking. While many animals have paw pads, the particular kind of soft, squishy beans found on house cats are an adaptation for stealth. Squishy beans mean you're looking at an ambush predator. These are the beans of a killer, Bella. Making art is literally actually like doing an exorcism. You have to get it out of your brain. You have to. I don't, I don't think that's true. Uh, Andy, what we did before, ask Amy if it's like an exorcism and then just give me a gif of her response. Yeah. <sighs> I woke up today and I don't like it. One time I dreamt the Undertale movie got released, and the only reason I found out was because my friend sent me a message in all caps telling me Addison Ray was Metaton. I <laughs> mean, kind of works. I don't know. Here's a picture of Addison Ray. Here's a picture of Metaton. Do, do, do the math. Reasons to be frog shaped. Reason one you are frog shaped. Reason two, you can sleep on a lily pad. Reason three, you may be one with the bog. Reason four, ultimate friend shape. And reasons five, from... <laughs> Concept, elves are supernaturally good at everything only because they live to be bonkers old. And if you were hot and sexy for thousands of years, you'd be kick-ass at archery and tree climbing and horseback riding too. But there's like, 20 year old elves out there that are just straight dumbasses who can't do shit. Concept, non-elves can't tell the 20 year old elves apart from the 2000 year old elves. And third concept, there's a 20 year old elf in your tavern and he's counting on this. If you ever look up to me, you're wrong. This isn't because I'm short, I'm not short. This is because today I was at the beach and I forgot what sand smelled like, so uh, I decided to stick my nose into the sand and snort, and it went absolutely not excellent. Yeah. Writing prompt. A murder mystery where every character believes themselves to be responsible for the death and tries their best to cover it up. <gasps> the real kicker is that the guy died from natural causes! I want this book. I wish my body was ablaze with astral charge. Could really do with some cosmic infinity coursing through my veins right now. Tremble before my might, whatever. Ah, the centuries of frozen slumber not treating you well? Yeah. Elephants, please stay in your car. Oh, come on, let the elephants get out and stretch the legs. They've probably been driving for a while. No, I'm not tired of being nice, and yes, I just still want to go ape shit. Things can coexist. Stop asking me. I want to be very nice, but in an ape shit kind of way. Me mentally flipping through the various daydream universes I crafted up like records in a crate. Hmm. Which fantasy shall I indulge in tonight? I hate that this is me. Okay, I'm just gonna say it. The word in parentheses meme is way better for tone indication than actual tone indicators. So true. Sexual intent. 
Sorry, what? <laughs> so just to avoid accidentally using offensive language, I'm just gonna start using 90s surfer dude slang because inadvertently offending someone is totally bogus, dude. You know, people might not want to be called dude. You are radically right, and that is so not tubular, my friend. I apologize. I find your poor grammar and spelling to be offensive to my eyes. Watch me catch this gnarly wave of I don't care! I just really cannot believe this fucking thing exists. Imagine making a robot this built, and its purpose is to play table tennis. I mean, this is just an anime dude for a sports anime about tabletop tennis. Tell me I'm wrong. Me as a Silent Hill protag. What the heck? What the hell just happened? What in god damn is going on here? What on earth? This door is locked. What is this? What's going on? <laughs> I don't mean to sound like a dick, but don't you also mean... <laughs> Ethan Winters from Resident Evil 8? Maintenance notice. We're crashing this site. With no survivors. Oh fuck, oh fuck, quick, get all the memes, oh shit, they're doing it right! Hmm, I wonder what you taste like. Battery acid, go away. Digital art is like, flip horizontally, flip horizontally, flip horizontally, flip horizontally, flip horizontally, flip horizontally. I refuse to flip because what I don't know can hurt me. Absolutely valid take. Or is it? Andy, flip the video. Oh god, this was a mistake, flip it back! Oh, thank god. You know, it's a shame that the Spanish word for cheeseburger is not hamburger queso. Why is it not? Yeah, I think Comfort Sons is pretty cool, though. Songs! I meant songs! Comfort Sons! I have one of those. Behold, this is Grape. He's my son. He's an absolute <laughs> bastard. You never pretended to be a bride when you were a little girl? No. Like, literally never? Why pretend to be a bride when you can be a meerkat? The premise of minimum wage, when it was introduced, was that a single wage earner should be able to own a home and support a family. That was what it was based on. A full-time job, any job, should be able to accomplish this. The fact people scoff at this idea if presented nowadays as though the people that ring up your groceries or hand you your burgers don't deserve the luxury of a home and a family is disgusting. Also, if a livable wage breaks the system, then the system deserves to be broken. Just saying. A young boy runs into the room, his short hair ruffled and glasses askew. His face is a light shade of pink and he seems out of breath, though he quickly composed himself, smoothing down his shirt and fixing his glasses. He extends his hand and opens his mouth to speak. Hi, I'm here to talk to you about your car's extended warranty. Oh my god, stop! Parents be getting upset when their head cannon for their child doesn't turn out to be cannon. Exactly, but never say it like that. Anime art styles where the eyes are so low and the mouth and nose are so high that they're almost on the same plane are terrifying. I'm cute! No, you're not! You're horrifying! I'm so sick of scrolling and then BOOM! Spike trap! Spike trap! Spike trap! Well, guess what, post below me? <laughs> BAM! <laughs> Fuck you! Eh, sandwich yourself, idiot. I like how there are two universal constants on Tumblr, and those are Jesse and James, and Doofus, Mertz, and Perry the Platypus. And honestly, good for them. It's what you call perfect character design. Mm -hmm. Oh boy, time to make a post on Tumblr. Surely no one will interpret it to be as offensive and bad intentioned as possible. Hey, not wanting anyone to disagree with your posts is- By Talos, this can't be happening! Like clockwork, holy shit! Ah, oh, fuck. I had an idea, god damn it! ADHD is fucking rad because I can be trying to make a silly sentence on Tumblr. Around the world, 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 around the world. Around the world. And that's how the body of Christ helped Johnny assassinate the president of the United States. Yeah. Why are we humans so good at bait and wait methods slash techniques? Nobody's matching you on Tumblr, huh, pal? Do kids these days make up songs about killing the Wiggles and Doc McStuffins, or did Barney the Dinosaur just unlock some latent primal rage in my generation? Probably. 
What if I... <laughs> TNT block. Redstone dust. No doubt! Ugh. Fine. Redstone torch. Son of a bitch! When I was little, I thought I could see people's auras, but in actuality, I just have bad eyesight. If cop could speak, they would all have French accents. Mon dieu, you have caught me. I don't think that was French. Your YouTube channel got more explodey. What changed? Explosions. In fact, Andy, for the course of this video, put tiny sad little explosions at random spots that no one expects them. Starting... Now, he stared at her with what was probably a normal amount of eyes. Probably. Two houses both alike in dignity never establishes the level of dignity they both obtain. This is usually assumed to be high, but it could in fact be extremely low. Thus, an adaptation of Romeo and Juliet with both houses being a rival clown troupe would not be in opposition to the text. In this essay, I will... <laughs> Where's the SAOP? Your friends love you. You are not a burden. But you don't weigh them down. They chose you. Lord help me because I can't stop saying I may have girl bossed too close to the sun to myself whenever I literally do anything. Okay, but well, now I will be too? Back when I worked at Walgreens, I didn't know which hazel was a real thing. People would come in asking for it, I'd be like, Yeah, it's on aisle three next to Wolfsbane and I and Newt, you fucking idiot bastard. Zoe, Wolfsbane is also a thing, and I of Newt is just the old-timey way of saying mustard seed. By Talos, this can't be happening again! If 666 is evil, then 25.806975801127 is the root of all evil. <laughs> You have a fucking calculator in your shower? At Pascal, while I'm number one, do the calculus just for fun. Messing with the new students at Secret Wizard College by making up spells that aren't real. <laughs> you don't even know how to cast Mungus Blast? What's a Mungus Blast? Wow, you don't even know about Mungus Blast? Please, I must know what a Mungus Blast is, I beg you, tell me! Look, if you must know, head down to the archives and ask what the hovering orb of knowledge what a Mungus Blast is. Make sure you ask really, really loud. Really loud. Fuck algebra! I don't need it! Just give me a dead body and I'll figure it out from here! I feel I should clarify I'm a mortuary science major. My aunt used to write horoscopes for the newspaper as a part-time job. She had a friend in college who A, always read that newspaper's horoscope, and B, didn't know my aunt wrote it. So whenever the friend had a shitty episode, my aunt would make her horoscope as positive as possible to cheer her up. Long story short, they recently got married and they're both my aunts now. What do you mean, long story short? Give me this entire Sammy K romance novel right now! Behold, proud boy. <gasps> a fellow gamer. The writer's blessing. May you write 1,500 words with ease. May your characters be lively and not cardboard. May you need a little editing. May your muse visit you as soon as you sit. May the internet not distract you much, and may your phone lie dormant while you write. Okay, but on the subject of writers, having writer friends is being like in the world's tiniest fandom. Except to get new content, you have to beat it out of the author with a stick. Being a writer is like being in the world's tiniest fandom, and you have to beat content out of yourself with a stick. Being a writer and having writer friends is like you're all in different fandoms and you take turns beating content out of each other with a stick! All hail the content whacking stick? You know, the most important thing they don't tell you about being gay is that as soon as you have any creative control over your appearance, you will start dressing like one or more of the Muppets. Does the Count from Sesame Street count as a Muppet? I think he counts like generally as his main character trait. Nine hours of studying, and I can't remember my own name, but I can remember how to kill a man using a toothbrush, so... There's that. The hell kind of classes are you taking? I'm a forensic criminologist. Our slogan is, can't run fast enough to be a serial killer, so I'll just help the police catch him. My dad just described the size of a large dog to me by saying, he could, like, stand up and make his own fucking dinner on the stove. I mean... It works. Marvel characters who are false advertising. Ant-Man, he can be any size, not just ant-sized. Cyclops, this fucker has two eyes, not just one. Winter Soldier, he's there all year round. Wolverine, 
doesn't wear a Wolverine fursuit. You'd think he was a furry, but no, he isn't. Iron Man suit made out of gold titanium alloy. Spider-Man only four limbs and doesn't shoot web out of his butt. And Mr. Fantastic, <laughs> he is just awful. So how important do you have to be to have been assassinated instead of murdered? That is a good question. Well, if the motivation is political, then it's assassination. Otherwise, it's murder. You can't be assassinated by accident. If a jilted ex murders the Prince of Placeland, it's just a murder. If a jilted ex is also a member of a rival political faction, it may be an assassination. Now, if a jilted ex is driving home in tears and accidentally runs over the Prince of Placeland in the middle of the night in a neighborhood where the streetlights are out because the prince has questionable infrastructure policy, it's manslaughter. Uh, thanks, murder side of Tumblr? Human DNA has an information storage capacity that very neatly fits the size of a GameCube game. Thus, it would be possible with gene editing technology to store a copy of Super Mario Sunshine inside the human genome. Details and image. Super Mario Broth Mad Scientist Moments? So what you're saying is... <laughs> I can run, dude!